Tim's News Explosion. In Victoria, uh, where our state debt is about to blow out by 2027, 28 to $188 billion, I, the our hospitals are being told uh, to make cuts. The Minister for Health, Marianne Thomas, has, has told hospitals to get rid of waste and duplication and said they won't get their budgets uh, topped up. Uh, if they fall into the red. And so hospitals are advising their staff to turn off the lights when they leave the room. But there's still money in the budget for our, politi our state politicians to get a 3.5% pay rise, although that was done by an independent uh, authority. Uh, the Metro Tunnel uh, blowout, uh, it's blown out from $11 billion, billion to $14 billion and won't be ready until the middle of next year. Uh, the state government, they'll provide additional funds uh, to get that finished uh, as well. There's always money for uh, the, the, the big build, uh, which the CFMEU uh, benefits for. And the Victorian government has also got uh, funding uh, for uh, this uh, new uh, pro-transgender advertising campaign. The unsaid says a lot. Think about what you're really saying. Everyone deserves to be safe and supported and equal. Help make Victoria more inclusive by supporting our trans and gender diverse communities. This is uh, the ad that is being uh, paid for uh, by our tax dollars uh, going around. Okay, let's unpack everything that was wrong with that ad, apart from the fact that it's a whole waste of our money. So it is pro-trans women, biological men in women's sports. So you saw that big uh, looking woman, trans woman, biological male uh, being invited to play, probably because that uh, the, the girls they wanted to win. They, of course, you didn't see the footage there of the trans woman biological male uh, flattening an opponent uh, <laughs> an opponent on the on the team a biological female and and injur injuring her and notice uh when that uh, old uh trans woman uh, was helped by an old chinese man uh, so clearly <laughs> even though <laughs> the chinese or well, this <laughs> aren't uh, pro <laughs> most of them aren't pro trans and you saw that uh, uh, freak who turned up at that barbecue and they all give it uh, a real hostile look, probably because they have made a scene before and demand to be uh, called a Z Z Zem. And then there's the 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 first one where that uh, that uh, woman uh, sees uh, the the trans woman biological male getting into the the lift and uh, leaves before the the lift opens because well, she doesn't feel safe or maybe she is put off because uh, the trans woman smells because of uh, bottom surgery going wrong because we spoke last week about how a trans woman biological male uh, committed suicide after 
a botched backyard orchorectomy, which was just cutting off the testicles, not uh, full bottom surgery. And and this is the thing: the having surgery down there can go absolutely horribly wrong and lead to well, lead to chronic pain and also uh, bowel and urinary issues where. Uh, you, uh, where you constantly smell. Uh, so, for example, uh, this is from some transgender surgery forum. Do I have uh, fistula? I had a colon vagoplasty last year, and although there have been spells where I had some discharge that's smelly brown, it's mostly not an issue. Over the last week, I've had a lot of discharge and it's literally brown and smells just like poop. People have actually noticed the smell and I've had to play along that it isn't me. I did have unprotected sex recently, although there was no ejaculation. So I'm looking into an SDI test to rule this out. Can this be a thing with colon vaginoplasty? Any advice on how to get rid of this? Could this be fistula? I'm absolutely out of my mind with grief. I'm devastated. I wanted the surgery all my life and I feel I could have, it could have went completely wrong. Please help me. So the meme comes true. I'm not sure if you've seen these memes where the uh, transgender in the corner says they don't know I've had bottom surgery. What's that smell? Something smells like shit. Tim's News Explosion. 